What we have here is we have UV units, and the UV units emit light. It literally is sunshine. Back in the day, they used to use UV as sterilizing water naturally. They would put water out, let the sun hit it, and it would sterilize the water. Well, now we basically condense that into a vessel that allows us to direct our water through it and get it more intensely so we don't have to wait as long. So UV is acting like the sunlight, it's just that we are able to concentrate it into a certain amount of spectrum. The UV light puts out 254 nanometers. And what that is doing is that when organics go by that, or bacteria or anything other than just water itself, what it does is it disinfects it. And the reason that this is important is because with fish, they don't react very well with other organics in the water. So they can get infections and things like that. Before UV, they would use chemicals. Chemicals could make the fish sick. You had to figure out how, many, how much chemicals to use. With situations like this, where you have a UV, you don't have to worry about chemicals. You don't have to worry about the fish getting sick because the UV only exists within the vessel. It's the last part of the system. And the reason for that is you want to take all of the big stuff out of the water before it goes through the UV. Because if you have leaves or anything like that, large items that are going through the UV, the, the light does not see past that. So you try to get all that stuff out. So basically it's the cleanest of the water that goes to the UV unit. The water would start from this side and go through here and it starts going through the vessel that UV or sunshine penetrates any bacteria, anything that is organic. The lamps do not touch the water. The lamps actually are inside quartz sleeves. So these sleeves protect the lamps from getting wet. And inside the lamp is gas. There isn't any filament or anything like that. It's all just gas that heats up and creates UV and will disinfect the water. So the way this is designed, that allows the water to linearly or laminarly flow through the vessel up the top. It's the end of the process. Then it'll go out to where all the fish are. And the water is clean and it will not harm any of the fish. The great thing about UV is it's just, it's just lamps in your water. You are no more than just plugging in a lamp and that lamp has now benefited your process your aquaculture system to an immense amount because you are killing anything that would keep you from harvesting as much fish as you could.